Her Majesty visits the textile section of the British Industries Fair at the White City. First, Queen Elizabeth makes a tour of the stands and displays the keenest interest, as for instance in these gaily coloured cloths made in Lancashire for export. Then, proceeding to the fashion theatre, Her Majesty spends 20 minutes watching a mannequin parade. She sees the bridal ensemble called Springtime of Love. The bride, her train bearers, and the two bridesmaids who carry shepherdess sunshades. Most striking in the millinery display are first a hat in Diamante called Cocktails, Lord Derby and Mr. Runciman seem to have the interest of experts. And a hat called Sports, designed to fasten beneath the chin for motoring. And for coronation year, coronation shoes, with a crown on the straps, and studded with diamonds and rubies, priced 600 pounds. Finally, a display which distinguishes 1937 from other years, the robes for the coronation. This is what a Viscountess will wear for the great occasion in May. A thrilling moment for the mannequin. Next day, it is the Olympia section which receives royal patronage. Here is displayed a wide variety of the produce of British manufacturers, and Olympia is given a magnificent send-off, thanks to the encouragement afforded by the visit of their majesties, the King and Queen, who are followed by the Duke and Duchess of Kent. The royal party makes a most thorough tour of the building, and Queen Mary's never-failing interest in all that pertains to British welfare must be a source of the greatest gratification to all concerned in the annual organization of Britain's shop window. <laughs>